back with another terribly bo bad book cover redo. Uh, last time I did this, I was actually kind of sick, so this time I will be a lot more uh, upbeat and happy. Um, so the book cover we have today, I also found from terribly bad book covers. If you like looking at horrible book covers, uh, I would give them a follow on Instagram. It's actually quite fun and it's given me a lot of inspiration for these book cover redos. Uh, if you don't know me, I'm uh, Jam Ivy. I am a graphic designer and book cover designer. Um, you can find some of my work on my website, jamivy.com. And yeah, let's just let's just get into this. I won't I won't do any more marketing schemes for you guys. Okay, so the book cover we have today is very interesting because I am going to try to replicate it the best I can. Okay, enough of that. I'm going to show you guys the book cover I'm going to do. And it's this. So, uh, already when I saw it, um, I don't know why I chose this one. Because you're dumb! Because you're dumb! It just, yeah, it just stood out to me. To be to be the one I gotta read you. So this looks like it's a historical fiction novel. Um, <laughs> um, right here we can see um, this is not centered, uh, which is a big problem, especially if you're getting this printed. Um, you you want it as centered as you can. Yeah, I'm not gonna go into it. <laughs> Um, I also love how they do not have shadows, how they're fake people on top of a real background, on top of pasted rocks. Um, yeah, it's, it, this is, it's a mess. Um, but it's actually halfway decent because of this up here, which is, um, you, you usually find this in historical fiction. So this kind of setup, even though it is not centered, this is driving me crazy. Uh, this should be closer. Yeah. Oh, okay. Anyway, I will stop boring you guys with my, uh, my centered, everything's got to be close together. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and look this book cover up, the blurb, and I will be right back because this time I am not reading the blurb. I will just fill you in later. <laughs> I'm, I'm terrible. Yeah. Um, guys, it has a hard cover. What? This has a hardcover? It has a hold on. That's hilarious. A division of Thomas Nelson. I, why do I feel like this is not legit? I am, I am going to Google this. Guys, we're going on a little adventure here. Because I don't think this is legit. Um, what? 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 Guys, this is real. What? Wait, what? No. 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 This cannot be a thing. Are you serious? One re- What? 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 Guys. What? What? Guys. I am a little bit shook right now because this is so bad. <laughs> This is so bad, and this is, this was published in 2011, it's only got one rating. What? I don't think this is legit. I really don't think. I don't think this is, I don't, I don't. Okay, I'm sorry guys, I, I need to, I need to chill. Wait. I am so confused. I am so confused. Okay, I'm just going to go ahead and read this. I'm not going to be 
I'm not going to be doing anything, okay? I've got not that much information to go on from the book blurb. Basically, it's about a dude who meets a girl. That That is basically the entire book blurb. He's like, oh, he wants to be like his dad, but he meets this girl who makes him rethink everything. So I really don't have that much to go on for this. So I just have the name. I just capped it. I, that's all I have to go on. So let's find out what I can do with it. Let's sing a song full of hope, full of pain. Why don't you sing along, my friend? For it's our last refrain. Forever young, never strong, ever brave. Okay, there we go. There's the finished version. All right, so this is what I would have given the author um, instead of uh, this over here. As you can see, this is not centered, and that's kind of a big thing for me, centered, uh, making sure everything is nicely placed together. Um, but yeah, this is what I would have done. Uh, I put this little thing here, uh, this little tagline, because that's kind of what I gathered <laughs> from the book blurb. Again, the book blurb is really, really short, and I really don't know much about this book. Um, if I had just read the blurb, I would not have picked up the book, uh, especially, especially since I'm a cover buyer. So if the cover does not speak to me, I usually do not pick up the book, um, unless it is from an author that I know and love. So. That's it for today's cover redesign. Uh, I hope you liked the time lapse that I went ahead and did. Um, and until next time, until I can choose another one, uh, have a great day. <laughs>